Hi guys! It's me, Joanne. Welcome to my channel. Um, yes, pasokan na naman ng aking anak this coming uh, Thursday. So, um, bumili kami ng bagong bag niya kasi ano na siya, grade 1 na siya. So, it's a new journey again for for him um, kasi grade 1 na siya. And it's very... Uh, Hey, watch out, Scott. He fell down. He's very excited, you know, because um, it's another it's another journey for him. And his kindergarten was already uh, was already done, so and he buys something like this for his um for his uh, cookies and yeah, this he must put some cookies in it. Um, and of yeah, sometimes sprout also, yeah, sometimes fruit, and mostly cookies that they put it here, the cookie, so he likes cookie. So, I also already wash your drink bus. I already washed that, so here. So, yeah, yeah, so this coming Thursday, uh, it's uh, school time, and... Uh, um, it's just like a yeah that's that's water Scott yeah because I, I wash it huh so yeah that's not Eric yeah that's not Eric yeah that's not Eric doesn't stay with you that's an iron yeah you can do that so in Thursday uh, I must go to school uh, yeah, normally, uh, normally in, in a different, in different yeah. school. In different school, yeah. In the in the crash. In the in, not in the crash, but in the lower school before you were just like in the kindergarten, and now you are in the echt. Uh, in the really. Uh, in the, yeah, new it's really in the classroom. My new teacher. That's your new teacher. Yes. Yeah. Well, wait a minute, you have to learn. Yeah. Oh, yeah, that's why, that's why she had... Uh, yeah, yeah, that's why she had uh, eyeglasses, huh? So, anyway, so this coming Thursday, um, he gonna go to school, so... And normally... Uh, wala akong ano wala akong trabaho kasi yung trabaho ko is Monday and Wednesday so uh, Tuesday and Thursday nasa bahay ako but um, my colleague she asked me if we can change it so she worked today and um, Wednesday kasi in Thursday uh, operahan siya sa kanyang kamay and then yeah and then I says yeah that's really uh, I really wanted to drop my son at school in the first day of school. But yeah, sometimes um, plan is changing, you know, so we cannot really, we cannot really hold, you know, we cannot control everything. Uh, uh, we must always, uh, you know, prefer everything. Uh, there is something, you know, changing also about the, about the schedule, you know. But he really understand it. So my husband, he must to work in the late shift, in Thursday. So he's the one they gonna bring my son at school, and then my mother in law she going to pick up my son, and then they gonna pick me up in station. Um, yeah, it's a little bit. It's not a little bit, but it's quite expensive now in this since the pandemic happened, and yeah, and then since you know. Uh, some part of of europe they're they're having a problem and then now we're also having a problem i think all over the world they have a problem about you know about about um gas because because here in, in in belgium especially in winter it's very cold so we really must use gas for heater and yeah we must also to be uh safe for that and yeah i think more wearing clothes uh it's because yeah it's it's quite expensive now and a lot of people they're 
yeah they're suffering ale they 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 the they affected they, they affected with it and yeah that's it's 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 some kind of this um in this new um modern life it's quite really expensive because we already we really feel it that i think it's not only in the philippines i think all over the world they feel it really the the crisis and yeah even if you work hard even if you have a lot of 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 uh, can you call it uh, a lot of uh sideline job like another part-time job i think i think it's not enough because if you have a child that you need to support them to go to school you have to buy um you have to buy uh, material for them for like for example bags notebooks pencil i know kind of projects you know and but um the the nicely here in belgium is um we only buy uh bags because in 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 elementary it's not so really like not the same in the philippines that you really must to you must you must to pay it like enrollment pay yes they have also uh you you will also pay it but it's not like uh it's i, I think it's it's every month because when he was in the kindergarten it's also every month that we pay it but it's not much um i think in the in the kindergarten and in elementary it's not really you didn't really um feel it the pressure about about the expenses of going to school but here about but i think in 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 high school and in, in college i think they feel it more because yes it's not only in the philippines that they also uh, affecting about this uh a crisis but it's really so like like what i said if you have a child and then they go to school especially if you have uh two or three children especially like also four it I think it's already uh, much more money like um, like now and also all kind of you know like because uh, here in Belgium they have like a camp you know that you can you can uh, you can put your children in the camp like it's 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 kind of group camp but it's also expensive and it's also like swimming lesson or whatever it is like uh, sports that they must to do to to join it's also quite expensive especially if you have two or three children it, because it's 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 cost a lot cost a lot in here in belgium um it's not like because we're living in another country we really um our life here is just like uh you know like uh how can you call it like we 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 live in the in the luxury luxury country but i but the reality is really uh it's not really true because we also if we also feel it the you know the 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 crisis that everything is going the price is going up you know so yeah um i think the only thing um um solution is not to make to uh, not not to make a lot of children you know because uh especially the 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 world is also getting older and older and people they you know like die yeah and everything is gonna get expensive and yeah we also must to think and about the so future better. yeah so we better. must also to to think about the future of our children you know not I only take, I take care of yeah children, yeah it's not only for yeah and then it's not only for you know for bring them here in this world we we also bed, give them a you know, rest of good future yeah my bed to hold. yeah my bed to hold. yeah yeah oh, yeah we must also to be uh you know responsible for everything it's just like um the bags that he that, that we bought for him that's also Why? quite expensive it's just like i think um yeah, but i don't know yeah I don't, I don't know anymore also how much it is but i think i think papa they uh papa they pay it something 100 euro plus yeah that's, that's yeah that expensive. is that is really quite expensive because uh bag and then and then how can you call it like um um like a favorite for your pokemon you know you know my favorites katika yeah that's well more yeah mm -hmm. And it's like uh, we bought um, for his uh, drink bottle, yeah, 
and then also like uh, 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 the cookies uh, box so that um, at school that I already have also um, something I I buy some lunch box but I it's from last year so it's still good but it, because I didn't use it this year so it's still it's still useful to to to, to use that um, lunch box so anyway yeah that's it it's 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 really quite expensive yeah it's not only in the philippines it's 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 all over the world you know and um i don't i don't i don't have Ale. i don't have right to complain with it that it's expensive because they have much more worse than in my situation um, they have a lot of people out there that didn't have food to eat every day. They didn't have job. Um, they're they're just like this one thing that I don't like it the most is you just like having and having and having and children and then it's and then expensive. you cannot eat, then you cannot give them you it's know you do yeah and you don't have uh, you cannot give them future you know you cannot you cannot feed them. It's okay if you if you want to have a child but. You have also to make a responsibility and you must also to be, you know, like make decision for everything, not only for yourself, but also for the children. And then in this kind of situation in, 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 in generation in this millennium, it's just like really um, no matter what, how you work, like if you work full time, it's like it's not really enough because if it's the, the, the that's everything is expensive in the grocery it's also expensive um sometimes we also spend um 80 euro and yeah and then we go we go every day it we go every day in the supermarket so yeah we cannot we cannot really say it that um um, but at least we can still have we still have food to eat, you know. And I still have job, and my husband is still they have also in job. Belgium. Yeah, but even though we're in Belgium, we also feel the the crisis, Scott. Yeah. Everything is also going up the price. So yeah, <clears throat> but in the other country, like the same, like in the Philippines, like where Nana they live, a lot of people there they're hungry, you know. They couldn't have any any food to eat. They couldn't buy any proper clothes you know and they couldn't they couldn't they couldn't buy any you know toys or something money. yeah no yeah if you don't have money you cannot eat huh? so you have to work so yeah you are very lucky you what you have in your life and I know how it feels also because back then I was also poor I also um, I also experienced about um that we cannot eat in one day because yeah my father is a fisherman and and and, and actually it's not only my mom my papa is not only a fisherman you have a lot of you know like a, a, a sideline job so uh, now and then he he can be a driver he can be a, a mechanic he can be a, a fisherman and yeah he's just like you know he he will do his job to be to have food on the table for like to bring some food when he came home and my mama is a la bandera so but even though like that i'm really proud of it because yeah um no one's no one's want to become a, a, a poor you know we, we we don't choose it it's just like you know it's just like uh that's the reality you know that's that's the world you know i think i think there is no rich and there's no poor you know because it's just like only the, in in our eyes you know that they have rich and they have the poor it's just like we we live we live in fa in in the same in the same level it's just like for us a human a human um a human mind you know so yeah it was like really oh how can i call it like this don't touch that one scott because yeah, it, you cannot you cannot remove that anymore, huh? It's gonna stay that forever to you in your skin. Yeah. Yeah. So yeah, it was like really well for this um, Thursday. I'm really curious for him because yeah, I'm I was at my work this coming Thursday and yeah, 
we shall see uh, what is gonna happen so i'm just like really uh curious with it so um and he he really understand it because the first time that when when he go to a kindergarten i was really like there but it was like the first day he was really crying but yeah he used to it now for that for the children for their classmates every time he's home he always said i miss my classmates i miss my teacher so now yeah i think i think he, because he said to me i want to wear i want to wear uh, cap and then eyeglass uh, shades because I want to be cool so it's something like that they, they just like starting it you know because mine is um, it's a boy so so yes um, I'm so very proud of it that he can already go to grade one and we shall see um, uh, about about his uh, what he's capable and um, if he's really love it to go to school so yeah but i hope he love it i think i i think not hoping but he really likes to go to school so yeah so anyway guys thank you so much for this uh video thank you thank you um to support me subscribe my channel guys and click the notification and click then the bell. yeah and then comment if you click want the uh, bell button right now. yeah and comment if you want to say something and about this video up. and thumbs up guys and thank you and god bless you guys and have a nice evening and we just like stay positive and no matter what so stay stay cool and to all the parents out there you guys are amazing and love your children and be be supportive be supportive parents be supportive mother and don't pressure your children so yeah so thank you guys so much have a nice day bye bye seeing eyes of mine you see there are no trees inside of me